Oh my god, hello. Long time no YouTube. I literally haven't posted a video in probably like two or three years. And I just had such an urge to get back on my YouTube grind. I've been loving watching YouTube again. I feel like I probably just fell off the beaten track. And I thought I'd bring you along the next couple of days. Not that I'm really up to anything too exciting, but I thought we could do a little vlog, a little week in the life. I've just finished getting ready because I am heading into town. I'm meeting Jody to do some content and then I'm actually going to film something really exciting with a really cool brand today, which I am so buzzing about. The little life vlog of the day, I've just gone really casual vibes. I actually only got this tracksuit the other day. It's from Kaya. I've never tried any of their stuff before, but oh my God, I really love the tracksuit. And I love that's wide leg. I just prefer a wide leg um, fit on my tracksuit. And then I'm just wearing my Adidas campuses. These are from JD. And just my denim little coach bag. Don't want to stay in my room, by the way. Um, but yeah, I have a little bag packed. I'm working with Planet Beauty Brown Thomas um, this month, which is insane. And I'm shooting some content for their socials. Um, so that's what I'm doing today. So yeah, I'm so excited to just go in and play with some products, play with some makeup and film some bits and bobs. So yeah, I have to be there half one. It's just currently 10 to 10. Gonna hopefully be in town by like just before 11, meet Jody, do some content, grab a coffee, head to Brown Thomas. That is the POA. Say hello. So, we're just grabbing a coffee and then we're going to do some content. What did you get? Oh, your iced oat latte. It actually looks really good. What's the name of this place? Clement and... Clement... Clement and... Eco? It's on uh, South William Street. It's actually really nice. nice. I got a... Don't spill that on your tracksuit. I know. But they... Me. I do spill everything on messy message. But they <laughs> do it in like a little hot chocolate bomb. Kind of. Isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, a little hot chocolate bomb, yeah. like a backdrop. What is City Girls? City Girls today. City Girls today. But he has nearly killed herself 17 times. I have. She's having a crazy day. I'm having a skitty brown. Skitty brown. <laughs> skitty brown. Skitty brain day. I can't speak properly. I can't think she was properly. Trying to say, you were trying to say, I can't think straight. And you said, <laughs> I can't sing tweet. <laughs> but you knew what I meant. I knew what I meant. I have a skitty brain too. Skitty brain too. But yeah, we're just going to do content. So, sleep. Bye. Guys, what did I tell you? Spills. Brain. She has the oh, thing. Oh, <laughs> <on me>. chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. I obviously didn't vlog much um, of yesterday. Filming in Plant Beauty was actually so fun, and I really hope. Um, they're happy with the content as well, fingers crossed. But yeah, it was actually unreal. It was so nice to just kind of be in a different setting for work for once, which was really nice. Um, but literally I was nearly two hours in traffic coming home yesterday. Dublin traffic is just so painful, so painful. And I literally like, on a good day, I'd get in, into town in like 45, 50 minutes. So nearly two hours. She was rough. I literally came home, had dinner, and then I vegetated on the couch for the evening because I was just so wrecked. I'm just popping on my morning skincare. And um, today is kind of a busy filming day. I have a good bit of brown work to get done, edited, and sent off. And then I also want to do a makeup look. And I also wanted to film some fashion bits. And I'm in the gym later, so... We're planning on a productive Thursday. I'm gonna write everything down in my head plan. I need to write things down or I just don't remember, apparently, to do things. I kind of love a day like this where I kind of have a good bit to do and get through and just have a nice little productive day. Sun is shining, glorious. Honestly, the weather just impacts my mood so much and I just feel like I can take on the world today when the sun's out. Okay. I'm gonna go get a cup of tea because I need a cup of tea. What time are we? Okay, it's half eight. So I'm gonna rot a little bit this morning because I feel slightly run down. We're gonna rot for a little bit and then we'll get stuck into my to-do list. Sleep. Just finished um, filming for the day. I got everything edited and sent off. I love when I get everything ticked off my to-do list. But I got two little um, makeup patches in the post and I thought we could have a little unboxing together. So this is from KVD Beauty. 
2023 was a year for the minimalist, but 2024 has given us an excuse to go maximalist. Say bye to the clean girl, hello to the mob wife. Love Brad and Jess from the KVD Beauty PR team. Oh my gosh, thank you, KVD. So we have the tattoo liner. I remember like when, even when KVD Beauty was Cafe on D Beauty, and you can only ever get it in like Sephora in America. And I remember I was on holidays and getting this for the first time was like, the best thing ever especially because i just used to watch everyone on youtube use this i haven't used this in years i'm actually really excited to give it a go again and then we have the full sleeve mascara and then this who is texting me this looks stunning so this is the long wear eyeshadow dazzle stick this is in the shade flash storm but oh my god i actually had a little look see at this earlier love the packaging but this actually looks so I it's probably not even gonna like pick up on camera at all. I doubt this is even gonna pick up on camera. Oh. Oh, why does like glitter just never capture as nicely? It's kind of like a duochrome. It has a bit of like a blue and green reflex to it. That is gorgeous. That I'm like, this is so nice. I'm so excited to look. I want to do like a really grungy, um, smoky gorgeousness look with this glitter look at that look at the shine of that <gasps> she's stunning thank you kvd beauty can't wait to create a mob wife glam from london this is their new wonder bomb i've actually seen this on tiktok oh the pure box is having some technical difficulties <laughs> hold on okay i'm gonna take that out Slay. That's cool. But this is her here. I want to see what the wand looks like. I'm intrigued to try this because I normally kind of prefer a mascara, a little bit more like a longer bristles. I'm excited to try. Thank you, Rimmel. Well, love yes. I need to just clean my room because it's always a mess after I film fashion bits. Um, and I'm gonna grab something to eat and then get ready for the gym. Good morning. I am just getting ready to go to the gym. I was in the gym last night and um, I feel like that's where I last vlogged was when I was finishing up work essay. Um, yeah, I was in the gym last night and it was just such a shit session. I don't know what's wrong with me this week. I just feel so like off this week and I just had no energy and I think I pushed myself too much because I had no energy and then I felt so sick and I had to like sit out a few rounds. Just hoping today's gym is a little bit better. In fit, I just have my little Sisters and Secrets hoodie. I absolutely love this hoodie so much. And then I'm just wearing my little blue um, bound set. Literally bound is my favorite gym gear ever. I, the only gym gear I really wear. Like I don't even really reach for like my Nike stuff or anything anymore. I literally live in these and they're an Irish brand and they're so slay. So we love them. I love the blue as well. This is actually my, one of my favorite colors I think in their collection. Oh, hey guys, we're back. We're just getting ready for torture. Us before the gym? Wait until me after my hair be like out of here. <laughs> Let us be red. Torture chamber. Torture chamber. Dot dot dot. Well, I'm gonna get matcha. Yeah, I'm gonna get a chai. We're gonna do a little silly little treat after, of course. I'm thinking it's Friday. Yeah. Happy Friday. Gorgeous happy Friday queens. You guys. You guys. <laughs> oh no, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> If you weren't well, you'd be sick. Going that was, I am right now. That class, I went and clattered myself. <laughs> Wait until you see my knee. Are you going to be able to get it? Yeah, it's we like had to do burpees, like, but jump over the rower. <laughs> and my right leg just didn't jump with my left. So I just went like, but long it's like half her body went dead. She just, oh, uh, it's like little blood spots. Yeah, it's going to go, whoa. Ooh. But like, no one else seeing. No one else seeing. I'm so red. I'm so red. Can you see? Just on here. There, on here. Oh my god, I forgot. Two faces. <laughs> oh well. My leg just said no. No, no. Can't say we don't work hard. Can't say we don't work Can't hard. Can't say we look at my hair. Today. And I had four clips in it today. And still did fuck all. The bob got thrown the around. The bob got... I really don't hey. feel well after. Well, we're gonna get matcha. You're well, right. I'm gonna get matcha. City little treat. Yeah. But in a while, we need to go shower because, oh yeah. god. Yeah. But happy like, Friday. Shania time to say. Friday slay. <laughs> Peace and love you guys. Peace and love you guys. Oh, how, do, how do the Gen Z's do the hearts? 
Chinese with me. A large shredded chicken. She smells good. Gorge. Keep a bit of sense of mystery here. I mean, you're lucky you're getting hidden by chicken. There is. <laughs> <laughs> so excited. I can think about this all day. Large trim one. Okay. This is our Chinese combo. We're on a Chinese buzz at the moment. We're on a chip or pizza buzz for a hot minute. But we're back on our Chinese Friday. You got the, Shit. the YouTube voice, all right? So that YouTube accent, man. No, I'm just talking to my friends. <laughs> <and it's voice. laughs> this is the voice you use when you buy something new and you show it to me. Yeah, I say it all the time. <laughs> okay. And then we're going to add our lovely, definitely probably not chicken, but it fucking tastes <laughs> nice. No veg for me, thank you. I'm not really a veggie can again. <laughs> Definitely none of my Chinese, anyways. Okay. She's looking glorious, you guys. Yeah, that's a bit much. Sorry. I'll let you away with it. International Women's Day, man. Okay. <laughs> that is yours. Thanks, Ben. And then we also get a little extra curry sauce for the occasion. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. you. I don't know where I last left. The vlog off but i know i didn't vlog really at all this weekend but yesterday we done like our mother's day celebration yesterday and we all went up to my auntie's house um on my mom and her sisters and all the girl cousins um we had a karaoke night and it was actually such a fun night i love my family I, they're just they're all cracked so it's always a good time today's plans it's currently piss and rain um i've been trying to get some work done this morning but it's just so dull nothing's going to plan so, yeah, the vibes are not vibing today. So we're going to have a little bit of a chill day. But I actually got a Cult Beauty order that I wanted to show you before I wrap the vlog up. First up, and I think this may be like a new skin favourite. So I've seen these on TikTok. They're the Ultraviolet SPF 50 Queen Screen Super Glow Drops. These are the bronze ones. They have like an illuminating one as well. Um, I love ultraviolet. I think that's how you say ultraviolet. Don't quote me on that one. Um, I love their sun cream. I use the SPF 50 and I have the like spray for over your makeup. Such a good range of SPF. But yeah, I seen these and I really want to pick them up. So they're just kind of like bronzy drops. That is all I put on my face today for my face. And then just some cream bronzer, cream blush, tiny bit of concealer. Really nice for like no makeup makeup days but also just for popping on top of your skincare to give you a little bit of bronze but yeah they're like a really nice um formula blend and easy i have like a bit of a breakout and like scarring on my cheek and they didn't like clinker or anything um i feel like these are just gonna be so nice for everyday wear I like the drunk elephant drops i just don't love them where i actually think this formula is a lot better in my opinion but yeah it gives you a gorgeous bronze i'm so glad i picked these up and the illuminating ones actually look really nice but i'm kind of glad i went with the bronze then i picked up another say blush i only recently got these blushes and i can't remember what shade i have i have like kind of the pinky shade not the baby pink just kind of the nice rosy pink shade and i literally am obsessed with these blushes so i had to get another shade this is shade poppy it's a gorgeous kind of like coral pink but these liquid blushes are beautiful they just give you like such a glass look to your skin but like really adding a nice flush of color um, and for something that has such a dewy finish they actually last really well on the skin and obviously blush is normally the first thing to go off your base but i find like throughout the day like i have the pinky tone on now that's been kind of on me 
for like the whole morning and afternoon and like it doesn't really budge like they just sit really really well on the skin I really pick up some more bits from say because I'm really impressed with the blushes another blush because I'm just a blush whore I'm just a blush whore blush is just my guilty pleasure I finally got my hands on one of the Patrick Ta blushes what are these actually called the double take cream and powder brush Joe, look how gorgeous the packaging is. I actually only have one other Patrick Ta products. I haven't tried much um, of his bits, but I got this in the shade She's Blushing. I actually love those kind of like muted rosy tones. I think especially coming to summer, these can be such nice tones to give you that really kind of like bronzy, sun-kissed um, look. And I've actually never tried the Patrick Ta technique of your cream... No, your powder first and cream on top. So I'm intrigued to try, but I already know I'm going to love this because the shade is just stunning and then another product i've tried recently that i've just absolutely fallen in love with the summer fridays lip oils these and cash beauty lip oils i think are my favorite lip oil formulas these are just so nice i have shade blush dreams the shade pink cloud so it's a really gorgeous like kind of like baby pink the formula of these is just so nice they just feel so lovely on your lips um, and they're not like sticky or anything and they do give a gorgeous like a flush of colour. The last thing I got is the Sol de Janeiro. This is the new scent, the Delicia Drench Body Butter. I also have the spray and I'm just obsessed with this. I got the travel size because I'm going away on holidays next month and I was like it actually just be handy to have the travel size to bring away at me but this just smells so good that's everything i got from cult beauty love a cult beauty haul but i think i'm gonna wrap the vlog up here because i want to try and vlog weekly um throughout this month so we will see how i get on i hope i do it and not come back to using another two or three years and be like hey youtube i'm back again if you made it this far thank you so much for watching and um, i hope you enjoyed the vlog if there's any other content or videos you would like to see maybe on youtube um do let me know because i've actually really enjoyed filming this so yeah hopefully see you next week and not in another two or three years slay queens talk to you later Bye.